Knoxville ice bears are uh, bearing down on the hunt for the 2023 SPHL President's Cup. The team plays game two of a three game series against the Huntsville Havoc tonight in round one of the playoffs. Thanks, guys. I'm joined now by Ice Bears owner, general manager, and president Mike Murray. Mike, this year, it's been a successful year for the Ice Bears, not only on the ice, but from the fan perspective. Multiple sellouts. What have you seen from the Ice Bears fan base this year that really stands out to you? I just think over the years, you know, we got they helped us get through that COVID year, which was crazy for everybody. But just all the promotions that we do and, and, and the participation that they uh, they come, you know, dressed for whatever it might be. It's uh, it's been off the charts this year. You know, we've averaged around 4,300 in this 5,000 seat arena. And like you said, had seven sellouts and they've been absolutely incredible. And you said tonight you guys are so close to almost having another sellout on the season. Just a few tickets left. This fan base, what separates them from other ones that you've seen around the SPHL? Uh, just the culture. I mean, the culture of this city, it's a winning town. This is the University of Tennessee. Obviously, it's a football town, but we have our hockey niche. There's only two professional hockey teams in the entire state of Tennessee, and we are one of them. And uh, to see them, uh, you know, kind of rally behind us. Everybody loves a winner in this town. And, you know, we've got banners up there to prove that we've won before. And our, our fans, especially tonight, this is a playoff game. So there's no real big hang, hang the hat promotion, but it's just playoffs. And, and they'll, be, they, they'll be here just like they've been all year. You said you've been doing this for the better part of two decades. I'm sure you've had many multiple interactions with fans throughout that time. Is there one that stands out to you from this past year or throughout all those years that you've been doing it in general? I, I just think, um, you know, obviously I'm, I'm going to be heading into my 20th season as an owner of the Ice Bears. And I just think that when I take a walk through the kids zone and see the kids that have been kids that are now have kids that have come through and are part of our kids club, uh, that's just how we foster things. We we cater to the women and the kids and the and the and the dads just love it too. So if the whole family's happy, the ice bears are happy and the building's full. We hope that we can make them even happier tonight with an ice bears win over the havoc. Mike, thank you so much for joining us. We're gonna be hearing from Mike and we have a few more updates coming up for you throughout the night. Back to you guys in the studio. Exciting stuff, Casey. Thank you so much. We'll have more updates, as Casey said, throughout the evening from the Civic Coliseum. Ahead of the Ice Bears taking on the Huntsville Havoc puck drop set for 735 tonight.